Koji Sato, the new CEO of Toyota, has promised to, dramatically, speed up the introduction of new electric vehicles as part of his effort to transform the largest automaker in the world into a mobility company. On February 13, Sato unveiled a new leadership team and stated that the next generation platform, which is anticipated to appear around 2026, would serve as the focal point of the EV offensive. The announcement comes as investors, environmentalists, and EV aficionados criticized Toyota Motor Corporation for behind in the worldwide EV race. Additionally, Toyota CEO Sato recently revealed a new lithium-free battery that will be used in a larger strategy to overtake Tesla. Join me as we explore this revolutionary new lithium-free battery that will transform the EV industry. Tesla and Toyota have distinct differences in the car sector in general. Toyota is the greatest in terms of revenue, whereas Tesla is the top in terms of market capitalization. Toyota is a traditional corporation that values quality and constant progress, whereas Tesla is an industry disruptor that values revolutionary innovations. Despite these advantages, both businesses are not without flaws. Toyota is subject to changes in consumer preferences and governmental laws due to its reliance on internal combustion engines, whereas Tesla faces unique dangers due to its high valuation and aggressive expansion plans. Toyota has created a number of technologies, such as hybrid electric systems, that are intended to increase fuel efficiency and lessen the environmental effect of its vehicles. But, this strategy is too slow and not revolutionary enough. However, Toyota is currently updating its EV strategy in an effort to better compete with Tesla after the appointment of Toyota CEO Sato. The Toyota research team is developing a lithium-free battery to replace the LFP4680 as another significant change. It's customary for businesses to publicly support environmental policies while secretly pursuing the opposite objectives, however Toyota flips this conventional logic on its head. While promoting gas guzzler SUVs to their customers, other automakers brag to the media about how excited they are about EVs. Leaders at Toyota actively lobby against government funding for electrification and publicly criticize EVs. But Toyota's engineers are exploring cutting-edge EV technologies back in the lab. Believe it or not, according to a recent Nikkei analysis, Toyota is by far the company with the most solid-state battery patents. Some of the top patent owners in this industry are also Japanese businesses. Even though solid-state batteries for electric vehicles are still in the prototype stage, they are widely anticipated to be the next big thing due to their longer range, quicker recharge periods, and lower fire risk. Since the 1990s, Toyota has been researching solid-state batteries. As a result, the company has obtained patents for a variety of uses, including battery structure, material, and production techniques. The automaker displayed a working prototype powered by a solid-state battery in 2020. In the same year, Toyota and Panasonic formed a joint venture through which they are collaborating to develop solid-state technologies. A breakthrough in magnesium conductivity makes solid-state electric vehicle batteries conceivable without costly lithium. As a result of the Toyota research team's discovery of a workable substitute using magnesium ions, manufacturing solid-state EV batteries without the rare and expensive lithium may soon become a reality. Magnesium is inexpensive and widely available, and after a prolonged struggle to increase its conductivity in solids, the material's drawbacks have been resolved. For the next generation of solid-state electric vehicle batteries, Toyota experts have figured out how to use inexpensive magnesium rather than pricey lithium. By including organic materials and an accelerator, the long-standing magnesium conductivity barrier that stood in the way of replacing lithium as a solid-state battery material has been eliminated. The research team provides the following justification for the discovery. We used a group of substances known as metal organic frameworks in our research. MOFs. MOFs, highly porous crystal structures give the contained ions plenty of room to move about in an effective manner. Acetonitrile was also injected into the MOF pores in this case, acting as a guest molecule, successfully increasing the conductivity of magnesium. In order to meet the threshold needed for practical implementation in solid-state batteries, the normally low level of conductivity of magnesium ions in solid materials at ambient temperature has been considerably boosted. Although the superconductivity of magnesium ions may have reached a record, it is still below what is needed to produce solid-state batteries in a practical manner, thus the Japanese research team is now concentrating on raising the conductivity level of the new magnesium-based material. Magnesium is a common element in the Earth's crust, unlike lithium, which is a rare Earth element. 
Elon Musk recently advised lithium mining firms, including those in Australia, to enter the refining business as well, calling it license to print money due to the dearth of battery-grade lithium refiners and the fact that the majority of them are in China. Electric car manufacturers will be able to break free from the near monopoly of Chinese lithium refiners by substituting magnesium for lithium in solid-state batteries, which will also drastically reduce the cost of the promising technology per unit cell. Any new study that makes solid-state batteries safer and more durable than current battery chemistries is excellent news for both the major manufacturers of electric vehicles and their potential customers. Solid-state batteries have several advantages over current battery chemistries, particularly in terms of safety and longevity. What are solid-state batteries and how do they differ from lithium-ion batteries? As with any other battery, solid-state batteries are electrochemical cells with an anode, a cathode, and an electrolyte. The electrolyte state is the primary distinction between them. Solid-state batteries use a solid electrolyte as opposed to liquid electrolytes, which are used in lithium-ion batteries. Advantages of solid-state batteries Compared to conventional batteries, solid-state batteries have a number of benefits. In addition to having a higher energy density, they are safer and have a longer lifespan. Let's examine their benefits in more detail. Solid-state batteries are more compact and lighter than conventional batteries. In light of this, they can be used in transportable power applications, as well as in ships, aircraft, and other electric vehicles. They have a 2.5 times higher energy density than standard lithium-ion batteries. Because of this, they are perfect for producing high-capacity modules and packed electric vehicle EV, battery systems. An improved level of safety is offered by solid-state batteries. It employs a solid electrolyte devoid of any combustible elements. Consequently, it has a longer lifespan and is less likely to catch fire. They can be quickly recharged. It recharges four to six times more quickly than existing battery technology, for example. Solid-state batteries can be produced significantly more quickly and with less energy and material input. They have good thermal stability, or the capacity to endure both low and high temperatures while maintaining longer battery life. Environmental benefits of solid-state batteries Solid-state batteries can reduce the carbon footprint of electric vehicles by about 39%, according to studies done by Transport and Environment T &E, from Minviro. According to the study, solid-state batteries can reduce their impact on the environment even more if they are made with raw materials that are sourced responsibly. In comparison to conventional mining methods using spodumene and sedimentary clay-based lithium sources, New mining approaches, such as recovering lithium from geothermal wells, have a far smaller negative environmental impact. The mining of lithium and other rare earth elements has increased as a result of lithium-ion batteries. Although lithium is not now considered an essential element, by 2030, 12 million lithium-ion batteries used in electric vehicles will have reached the end of their useful lives and will need to be disposed of. To stop the creation of hazardous waste, lessen environmental contamination, guarantee the availability of lithium supplies in the future, and reduce the price of raw materials, these electric batteries will need to be recycled. Recycling or recovering materials from these used batteries is not, however, pollution-free. For instance, pyrometallurgical recycling consumes energy and endangers the environment by emitting greenhouse gases. Solid-state batteries, on the other hand, last longer than lithium-ion batteries. As opposed to the lithium-ion battery's two-year lifespan, the charge-discharge-recharge life can last up to 10 years. The environment will greatly benefit from prolonged battery life because it will cut down on production costs and battery waste. So, there you have folks. Do you think solid-state batteries are the next holy grail for EV batteries? Let us know your thoughts in the comment box below. Thanks for tuning in, and be sure to subscribe to our channel for more updates on EVs and all the latest news in the EV industry.